Health Minister Nicholas Steele says Grenada remains COVID-19 free as the final eight persons being monitored in quarantine were sent home. With zero cases, that includes anyone that was in quarantine or so. We have individuals that are coming in and remain in quarantine um, for the, the necessary testing and observation. But to date, there are no positive cases. Um, and, and with our fingers crossed, we hope that that would continue. But we have the necessary precautions in place. People have been apprehensive about the reopening of Grenada's airport. However, with only chartered flights allowed entry from July 1st, health officials say the necessary protocols have been put in place and are being followed to limit the possibility of spreading the virus. Declared COVID-19 free, government has now lifted the curfew. The new emergency powers COVID-19 regulations, which applies from 7 a.m. on the 7th day of July 2020 and ending at 11.59 p.m. on the 14th day of July 2020. What does that mean? Minister Steele explains. For the, 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 quarantine, the sorry, curfew that existed, um, we believe right now the risk level is low enough that we can remove that curfew restriction. It doesn't mean that the risk level is no longer existent, but we believe the risk level is low enough. That's why we're still asking people to wear masks, because we still do have people transiting in and out, and we still must be cautious. We've seen other countries that cautiously, we can also move forward with a certain amount of freedoms. Um, and if and when we see that that risk level were to increase, we then would take the necessary measures. Despite the curfew being lifted, not all businesses will be opened. Only those given permission under Section 5 and those granted permission by the Commissioner of Police acting under the direction of Cabinet. The Minister provides a further explanation on restrictions that remains in place. The, the gatherings, the mass gatherings are what we would like to avoid, but people can celebrate. Now, we would like to avoid mass gatherings, but, but we, we, we know that we are a, a, a free people, so to speak. Um, and and we, we, we come and go as we would like. So just with the necessary precautions, people can visit each other, uh, but, but avoid large, large groups. We've seen throughout the world, nightclubs and those type of activities have caused mass spread. So therefore, that's why although we've removed the, the, the curfew restrictions, we're still seeing that activity of mass gatherings, as much as I like it, like anyone else, we, we, we need to, to, to not have those right now um, so that we don't, we don't spoil this good thing that we have. Christina John, GBN News.